you may want to think twice before buying everything on your back to school shopping list. Many school supplies like backpacks, lunch boxes and notebooks contain toxic chemicals called phthalates. Phthalates are already banned in toys, but Senator Schumer says that's not enough. Why, for instance, would a uh, would you ban phthalates in a Spider-Man action toy, but not in a Spider-Man lunchbox or a Spider-Man backpack? The Center for Health, Environment and Justice says phthalates and PVC are linked to long-term problems like asthma, obesity and cancer. But clinical toxicologist Dr. Alexander Garrard says not so fast. There's really no risk with handling a book bag. If that were the case, then we would all have cancer. We would all have diabetes. We would all have all these other things. Um, and we're just not seeing that directly related to this. If you're concerned about the chemicals that are in some of the back to school supplies, some companies are now making it easier for you to tell if their products are PVC free. This binder is actually labeled PVC free, so you can look for things like that if you're concerned about chemicals when you're going shopping for supplies. For one parent, news of the chemicals wasn't too surprising. Uh, I would say probably surprised pretty much right down the middle. Surprised yet not shocked. Why not? I just don't think regulations are that strict on a lot of different things. If you're looking to avoid these chemicals, the Center for Health, Environment and Justice recommends things like not buying notebooks with plastic coatings, backpacks with shiny designs or colored paper clips. And when in doubt, always check the label. In Syracuse, I'm Katie Corrado.